Hello and welcome to my channel. So I was just playing Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 and I got this error KCD2 error fail to load the game DLL WH game dot DLL. So in this video I'm gonna be showing you possible ways to fix this error by which I have solved this issue but for you I'm making this guide so make sure to don't skip any part and so let's get started the video without wasting any time. So first of all guys we're gonna be deleting cache memory so in order to open it right click on the start button and click on run or press on your keyboard windows plus r button together so type temp temp control plus a delete all the files in it and skip the file that cannot be deleted again open run now type percentage sign before and after the temp also delete all the files in it Now at the end make sure to empty your recycle bin completely. As you guys can see I have freed about 11 to 12 GB of cache memory or trash files in my computer. So this will help you to fix the problem. After that, there is a link given in the description for this fix pack 2025. Make sure to download it from my website and there will be some ads on my website. Make sure to close all the pop-ups ads which open in the new tab and the download link will be open on the same page. After downloading it, open this pack, you will see 4 files in it. Open up this DirectX installer from Microsoft. This will update your DirectX version to the latest version if it requires an update. Uncheck this box. While it's uh, updating, go back and open this in Hibernate in Windows. And disable this Hibernate. You guys can enable it after if you want. But I'm gonna disable it. Open up this user account also disable it and it says you have to restart your PC so we will restart after and these are some CMD commands DuckTex is updated close it and these are some CMD commands go to search bar and type CMD right click on it and click on run as administrator command promote now you guys have to copy this first command ctrl plus c to copy it and paste in here ctrl plus v to paste and press enter and you will see ultimate performance is activated now copy these three commands and paste in cmd press enter the operation has successfully completed and a reboot is required for this to take effect so now type exit press enter now we're gonna restart our pc and i'll back after the restarting <laughs> 